Let's have a look at some of the highlights from round two. And Lucas Lee in the fifth hole to kick it all off. And this was his birdie putt. At the par five to take him to four under. Yes, young Brazilian. Playing very well for the opening two days. As is this young fellow, Jake Higginbottom. Rolling it beautifully on the greens. This was his ninth hole of the day, the 18th hole, and took him nicely to six under par at that stage. Lucas Lee was still in the action. This one at the sixth hole. Yeah, it's a great chip shot, Brendan. He had to pitch it into the fringe and then down onto the green very fast. And a wonderful shot. Andrew Dote at the third. And this was his second shot. Set up a birdie. Great to see him back in some form, Andrew. 2010 Avantha Masters oh. winner on the European Tour and played good a couple of weeks ago at Yapoon up in the Queensland Tropo circuit. Good to see him continuing his good form. Well, at the fifth Higginbottom, this was his second shot in. Seven under at this stage. There's a beautiful long fairway wood here. Have a look at this one, an absolute cracker. He went on to two putt and make birdie there to go to eight under par at that stage. Well, Andrew Dote at the sixth. Out of the bunker, third shot. Yeah, it's a really good shot. Good touch, look at that. One bounce, two check. Lovely shot, tap that in for birdie. And the 18th hole for Cameron Smith, his birdie putt. Yeah, 20-year-old from uh, Wontima Golf Club up in Queensland and also Royal Queensland. Just freshly turned pro. Bright prospect in Australian golf. And Higginbottom, he was 800 at this stage and this was a par putt. At the par four, ninth. Yeah, had a three-shot lead at this stage, young Jake, and that was his first bogey in 36 holes and it came at the final hole. That's some play. And finished at seven under. And top of the leaderboard. China's number one player, Liang Wang Chong. Nice touch here on the par five in two, and then rolled this one down to make birdie. Unfortunately, two holes later, he made a quick triple at nine. Still hanging on in there. And Vijay Singh at the sixth. An eagle putt. Ooh. He's unlucky. Don't get much closer than that. But that's the story of VJ's day to day. He just couldn't make enough putts. He made a couple late, but nothing early. Stephen Jeffress for his birdie putt downhill. Yeah, good to see Stevie playing well. Grew up at Port Macquarie and now plays out of the Southport Golf Club on the Gold Coast. Good to see him well and truly in contention. I took him to a five under and at the 15th hole. VJ Singh for birdie. Made nothing all day. He made a birdie putt on the previous green from three feet and then made that one. But unfortunately, the very next hole, he made a quick double bogey. So tough conditions and that's the way it sits of round two of the Fiji International. Jason Scribner there still with one hole to go. West, young Western Australian playing very well today even. It's been tough afternoon out there for these players. Stephen Jeffress, one of the rounds of the afternoon right there, shot a two under par 70. Built for a wonderful weekend. Looking forward to round three tomorrow at the Fiji International.